What's up comic book readers, welcome to Too Many Comics, I'm your host Eric and today we are taking a look at a title published by Fantagraphics, Like a Velvet Glove, Cast in Iron, written and drawn by Daniel Klaus. Originally published in serial form in the first 10 issues of 8-Ball that ran from 1989 to 1993, Like a Velvet Glove, Cast in Iron is a surreal story following the main character Clay Loudermilk in his search for his estranged wife, Barbara Allen. The story kicks off with Clay entering a movie theater presenting a strangely compelling but also demented film. Staring at dominatrix, Clay will soon find out as she will unveil her face that she is actually his wife. From there on, he will sink into a search for the love of his past and encounter numerous events. From the first chapter, Klaus brings forth a dreamlike world of sexual fetishism and bizarre transformations. The close to absent plot is driven from strange coincidences crammed with symbolism, referring to pop culture and cult cinema. The main protagonist will encounter many prosaic situations in his journey that will soon take a fantastic turnout. From the Swami-like character that shares knowledge from a man's room stall to being arrested by sadistic policemen that will beat him and tattoo a smiley face under his feet in exchange for his liberty, like a velvet glove cast in iron brings the reader in uncomfortable places while always staying captivating. From an art's perspective, the book is impeccable. Klaus' combination of skilled rendering and campy graphic style really captures the weirdness of this world marvelously. The juxtaposition between the words that handles the emotions and the art that is meant to shock creates a sense of overwhelming and strange neurosis. From Dan Klaus being one of the great modern masters of comics, this book is a must read for anyone interested in the medium or anyone who wishes to dig into the alternative scene. Well this is it for this video and until next time, keep on reading!